I just passed this poor dude. He has no idea. I feel so bad for him because he's trying to go up just this little hill. It's like 1% incline or whatever. And he's just in a high gear fucking grinding the pedals. Like, dude, low gear. Like, I would fucking blaze past you in, like, the lowest gear. He's like, you know, you can't even go in a straight line. Just no idea. So feel bad for him. He just isn't educated. I was like that at one point, too. Um, on my way to go hang out with this cool girl. Obviously, she's a vegan. Got both the bikes in the back seat. Gonna have some adventures in Vermont. Um, so yeah, fucking, ugh, gotta stop using that word so much. Um, the best advice, or some of the best advice I've ever gotten, or I, I will ever get, is don't wait. Don't wait to uh, d do what you wanna do. Or, you know, to follow your dreams, whatever. Don't wait, that is some of the best advice I've ever received. But it can be confusing because it's not telling you what to do, it's just saying, do what you wanna do. So it can be confusing, like, you can't give blanket advice to people to whether they should go to school or not, whether they should quit their job or not and stuff. But here's like a little bit about, uh, maybe, maybe, uh, maybe just a bit of advice for people who are thinking of just like, oh man, I, I, I my job's like holding me back. I, I really want to like succeed, but I can't because of my job. Uh, don't blame your lack of success on your job. You have, you know, you have that job for a reason. So if your job is holding you back and you do have a vision and you, I, you know, you have a short term as well as long term goals, um, and it's time to let go of your job. Yeah, definitely. But um, one reason not to quit your job is is uh are are you are you waiting are you waiting for something to happen for you to to uh because uh, this guy's yelling at me oh no he's rocking out yeah <laughs> yeah um are you, are you waiting for something to happen before you can uh start getting what you need done done so are you waiting you know are are you not fucking attacking your goals because you feel like a victim because uh, you have a job like a you know 40 hours 50 hours 60 hours whatever um, of work are, are you not attacking your goals and blaming that uh, blaming your job for you not attacking your goals so um, the, the don't wait advice don't wait to quit your job <laughs> to start attacking your goals you know, start attacking your fucking goals and be good at it before you decide to just jump off and like start something that you've never even accomplished. Another thing um, that I, uh, in my experience, I I was like, I, I've always played guitar since like sixth grade, since I was tw uh, 13 years old, or no, since I was like 11 years old. Played guitar for 12 years. Um, but never been a songwriter really in my life. Uh, not not to any serious extent at all um, and I, I, I hit the road you know when I started my little homeless street street person journey um, I hit the road with my guitar I had like a little travel guitar and uh, I was like yeah you know I'm gonna start becoming like now I got all this freedom and I, I'm gonna really start writing songs and you know uh, busk on the street. Busking is like playing music in public. You know, maybe maybe people would like toss a buck or two in your hat and I'm like, yeah, like, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna become a busker. And I was like, but I, I waited for the for the so-called freedom to come, you know, or the, the uh, extended freedom, the extra freedom. I waited for that and, and I didn't even follow through even after that. So it's like, if you're not attacking your goals, like don't don't even worry about making adjustments in your life. Uh, attack your goals first. That is definitely step one. Do it. Step one. Fucking don't just get started. Execute. Get it done. Step one. You know, it, quitting the job or selling your car or moving to Thailand. All that stuff comes after. You need to become boss at what you do first. 
So don't wait, you know, um, to, to live your dreams. And if you're ready for that, absolutely don't wait. You know, if you're ready to move, you know, move to a tropical paradise or you're ready to uh, d do X, Y, Z, you're, um, don't wait. Uh, same, same concept, you know, but th this, uh, this advice, this solid fucking advice not to wait, um, it, it doesn't mean that people misinterpret it. You, you know what I mean? There you go.